Hey everyone, so today is going to be a little bit of a first vlog video. I just decided to start this video with me just kind of talking about the whole process of what we've gone through before we get to the stage of the vlog that I'm going to show you later. Before we jump into this video, please make sure that you subscribe before you leave and we'll jump on in and get started. Me and my husband have been in the process of building a house for quite some time. Um, it's taken so long to get to this stage. Um, we started this process in February of this year and the council has just been taking their time even though we were ready months ago. So we were ready, we had picked the house we wanted, everything that was supposed to be in the house we had picked probably about eight months ago. So the first two months was just us getting everything organised the way that we want it to be and after that we were just waiting for the council. <laughs> Um, and then it turns out that the council was ready the day that we left for Thailand, so <laughs> we ended up having to wait another week and a half to actually be able to finish the process of buying the land. So once I hit settlement date, that was I think a month ago, yeah it was about a month ago that we got our settlement already, and yeah, so this week our slab went down, and it was about time to be honest. Oh, it's taken so long. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to go through a little bit of the process and how it works and all that kind of stuff. And then I will jump into the vlog and show you where our house is at. So we first decided to build a house at the start of the year. Um, we figured that we're sick of paying for somebody else to have a house. And we want to be paying off our own house so that we have a, a house in the future that we can give to our kids one day. So... Yeah, we just wanted our own house. We don't want to be paying for somebody else's house anymore. We want our own house. We want it to be the way we want it. We want to be allowed to put pictures on the wall and be allowed to do renovations and change things. So, literally, in a rental, you cannot put anything on the wall. <laughs> like, I want to be able to put pictures on the wall. I want to put my wedding pictures on the wall. And I can't do that in this house. So, we're getting a house. We have made it exactly, well not exactly how we want it because getting it exactly how you want it would make it so damn expensive but we've got it close to how we want it so we just went for a walk into a display home one day um, with no intention of actually buying a house no intention of actually like getting onto buying a house at all we just went into this home to see what it looked like um, and yeah we were just like, oh, this looks cool. Um, we met the guy that was at that display home. His name was Michael, and he was very, very helpful. Um, I guess that's what their job is, but when we walked in, we had no intention of even what we wanted, if we were going to build a house yet, or like what we were looking for. By the end of the time we walked out, which was like probably two hours later, we spent so long in there. He basically brought us over to his little workspace, he drew up our plan, like we got the plan off the computer, he drew it to size of like a block that we would want. Um, he started looking for blocks for us and yeah, it was really, really helpful. So he'd be emailing James like every day and James would be just emailing you back with little changes that we wanted to make to the plans and he'd just do it straight away. We'd get, our, we'd get another email back a few hours later with the changes. And yeah, he was so, so helpful. Like, he just wanted everything to be exactly how we wanted it. And that was great. So, we found that that process was really... But yeah, so we did that. We got our plans. We, like, figured out everything that we wanted. And then we just had to find the land. Um, so, we did a little bit of research. Probably took us probably a couple of weeks to actually find the land that we wanted for the right price. Um, and yeah, so we finally found some land. And we got the process all rolling. So, when you sign your build contract, you obviously sign it for what the packages that you get but when you're actually going into the colour state uh, the colour picking process I think that it's just called colours um, you go pick out all your floorboards and your tiles and all that kind of stuff um, so when you go there that's when the prices can change so when you go and walk into a display home and you go like how much is this display home exactly how it is they don't tell you how much it is for what is actually in the house they tell you the base of what you everything basic is so you can pick a basic plan and when you go to pick your colors so your flooring your tiles everything like that that's when your price actually goes up so 
If you're picking a display home, all you're going to get is the basic everything. So if you want your carpet to be a bit of a bit of quality, or a different colour, or anything like that, it's going to cost you. <laughs> but they don't tell you that when you're actually going to build the house. They tell you that when you get to colours. So we, we ended up spending a lot more than what we planned on because we weren't going to go for the basic carpet and the basic tile or flooring and you know the basic um, shower taps. Like we didn't want the two twisty ones. We wanted like one of the mixes. So that cost extra. And yeah, so they don't tell you all of that until you actually go to colours to pick everything. When we went to go and pick all of our colours, the lady was quite pushy. And I felt really shitty about that because, like, if I'm going to go spend as much as we are on this house, I kind of want everything to be perfect. So for her to be a little bit pushy um, with what I should be picking was a little bit confronting because I was just like, no, give me a second. Like, I want to pick the right colour here. <laughs> I don't want to see my house when it's done and go, well, that's only like that because she pushed me, you know what I mean? Like, I want to be able to pick everything for it to be perfect. <laughs> so that was annoying, but um, obviously she's doing her job trying to get everything done so that she can get another person in there and get them done too, but, you know, it was just annoying. But yeah, so we're finally at the stage where the house is actually getting built. <laughs> um, so we were just waiting on them really now, and... Um, James got an email the other day saying that our slab had been poured, so we were pretty excited about that. We had to go down and have a look at it and get a little family photo to actually announce that we were even doing this. <laughs> no one even knew we were doing this, so um, yeah, <laughs> now you do. But yeah, so I will insert the little vlog clip here for you to have a look at what is going on in our house right now. Hey Finn! Hello. <laughs> Alright, so we've just come to check out the slab. I will take you out and have a look at it. This is super exciting. We brought Finn to come and see it as well so that we can take a family photo. So excited. <laughs> is our garage and the porch is over here then James is walking around in our master bedroom and my uh, closet and then over there is obviously the um, the bathrooms so we've got the ensuite bathroom and then back of that is just our normal bathroom for guests <laughs> the fins up the back there Please don't tell him he's doing a poo. <laughs> he's just done a shit. <laughs> oh. And then in this front part here, we're going to have a dining and living room. And then that will go to our, ma um, our main uh, lounge room and kitchen and a rumpus room at the back. And we've got three other bedrooms. So, yeah. It'll be easier to be able to see it when we have our framing up. Which I'll obviously be vlogging that too. <laughs> it's getting exciting. I just thought that I would start filming some vlog videos and started with this because I thought it would be easiest to get me into the swing of doing that. So yeah, this is my future house and I'm so excited about it. Remember that if you want to see any more of these videos then make sure that you subscribe down below. So we didn't get to see this um, actual stage of our house but this is what it looks like before the slab goes down. The wind's all fucking hard. Are you excited? Alrighty guys, so this was my first ever vlog, so that's why it's kind of like this. I've done a little intro and an outro because I've never really done a vlog before, so I didn't want it to be just like a minute of me going like, hey, this is what's going on in my life. Uh. 
<laughs> you know, like I actually wanted to make a proper video out of it and also discuss everything, well, talk to you about everything that goes on when you're building a house. So that is the first stage of the house build and I will continue this vlog throughout the build and yeah. I will, I'm so excited to see what it looks like in the end. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, remember to give it a thumbs up and subscribe before you leave. And I will see you in my next vlog. <laughs> Bye guys.